So everyone's always like, why startups? Why John? Why would you why would you do it? You can make way more money, you know, you paid all this money for your education, you can do better. And my real reason is that I hate the statistic for startups. It's only one in ten make it. The the drive that they have, their passion, it keeps me driven, like you know, they're hungry. You never know who you're sitting in the room with. Like they could be the next big thing. Like realistically speaking, I'm never gonna be the attorney for Facebook. But if I build the next Facebook or help build the next Facebook, well then I can be the attorney for Facebook. It's really a great feeling, it's really rewarding being able to help somebody, watching them grow, watching them grow their team. You know, someone starting out as a single person comes to my office like, John, I wanna do this, and that just like, it gets me all like, we're gonna get this together. That's, we're gonna do whatever we have to do to make sure this works if you want it, okay? If you have good character and I can see that you really want it, I will do anything to work with you and make sure we get there and get to where you wanna be. Because when I sit down with a client, first thing I do is, I say, tell me your story. Tell me how you got here. What brought you here? Because I need to understand how you tick. And then I want to understand your idea. And then I want to understand where you want to go with this. And then I'll play your devil's advocate. Then I'll just rip your business apart. And I'll ask you all those hard questions and everything like that. Because everyone will tell you your idea is good. You know, you can tell your parents, you tell your friends, oh, it's great, it's gonna make it. But you know, they're supporting you, which they should, but you kind of maybe need a gut check sometimes. And that's what I like to do. Because I want to push people. This isn't easy. It's, you know, people that tell you it's gonna be easy, they're just lying. That's kind of an insult to people that make it, saying that anybody can make it. It's just, that's not the truth. But you could make it if you have the right guidance and things like that. New York teaches you, like, how to hustle. Like, this is like the center of the universe. I think John Lennon said, if I, if I lived in Roman times, I'd live in Rome, and New York City would be Rome itself. That's why I like being here. So that's like the hustle bustle of everything, being in the city, and, you know, it kind of gives you this, this feeling when you walk out every day, I smell that great air or something like that. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but it, it's a high you get, you know, just working in the city. And, and we're a Wall Street law firm that works with Main Street, pretty much. That's what we like to do. Startups are really the future. That's where this is going. No one really gets out of college and wants to work nine to five. They're just like, I want to start my own thing. But they need help, they need guidance. I mean, you don't know what you don't know. You're not supposed to know what you don't know. I'm supposed to know that. And that's what I'm here for, that's kind of my job. So, you know, people say all the time, you can make more money, you can do it better, and things like that. And, you know, I'd rather work with startups, I've been trading into the world, so.